Hi, this is the DIY Affiliate, and welcome. I'm glad you're here. Are you tired of doing videos? Do you just not want to show your face? Or do you just not want to work on your laptop? Well, I put together a system in which you don't have to. You can use your cell phone and free apps that I call the DIY method in which you can create content so that you can reach your 1000 subscriptions and your 4000 watch time hours. So stay tuned. It's coming up. Hello, this is the DIY Affiliate bringing you yet another tutorial. Today we are going to find a Creative Commons, download it, and then re-upload it to YouTube, make a thumbnail, and process the video. Let's get started. The first place that you go is to your Play Store and you type in share and download. This is what it looks like. And then you open it. You then go to your YouTube and you look for something that you want to download. Make sure that it is in Creative Commons. A look at it. Click the share, find your share and download, show links, choose the way you want to download it. Go to your file manager, and if you don't have a file manager, I have a file manager there that I use, and it is also found at the Play Store. I will leave the link in the bottom. Into your videos where you will find your share and down your share and download file click it click share youtube change your Change your title. Click the arrow. And as it is uploading to your video, your videos in your YouTube go into your Play Store type in th the one that I am using reviewing right now is right there open it
create ready made my save my edit so we are going to create find the size that you are looking for for us it's YouTube either choose a background or use a background from your camera or your gallery I'm just going to choose one from my gallery open it there you have your your photo that you chose text You can choose your font. You have all different types of fonts here that you can choose from that you if you wanted to use. Your color. You can also choose your letter space and if you just click this one it will make it, it the spacing in between the letters um, wider or also the line if you wanted to take that down or move it up you can put a sticker on Just going to use a banner. You can choose any sticker that you want. Just going to choose a ribbon. You can also put another image if you choose to. Just gonna I downloaded another program, it's called Gallery.
And then when you're ready, you could also change the effect. When you're ready, you would then download it. And it would then go into my into my files. Go back to your, um, go into your YouTube studio. And that is another program that you would be downloading. Click into the video that you have uploaded, the Creative Commons. And then the pencil, edit thumbnail, change. So this is the one that I created there, select. So now I've changed the thumbnail, I changed the title, I changed the description, and I've now changed the, uh, I've also changed tags. Now there is another program that you can use for your tags, and it is called I'm just going to go to the Play Store right there. And then you're just going to type in keywords. And I will show you the program that I am using. Keyword suggestion. So the keyword suggestion tool for YouTube. Open. And then... Yes, I agree. And where you wanted to use it with... And then search for your keyword, and I'm using Chakra. You see how it starts to come up? So I would find some keywords that I wanted to use here. press down and then I would select the keywords that I wanted to use, copy them back into my YT Studio, into my tags and then put my keywords in there go into your playlists, find where do you want to put your a new video your, for your Creative Commons video. So I've chosen a couple of places where I wanted to put the video as a playlist and then save. So it's saving the changes. Now I just wanted to make sure of one thing. I wanted to make sure that number one, I always do my license as Creative Commons, allow comments, allow embedding. Okay. So now I now have my video. It will now appear on my channel and it will be connected to um, other playlists as well. I am grateful for all new subscriptions and if you leave me a comment it is good for me and it's also good for you because engagement is really important when it comes to the YouTube algorithm and I will go and I will check out your channel and I will like and subscribe to help you to be able to grow as well. Sharing all knowledge is free, and we should all share our knowledge to build 
a community of like-minded people who are willing to help each other out to grow online.